He wants to use your gift to conquer his enemies. Says the woman who incarcerated you in an endless nightmare. When the master confronts Pilgrim and says that he has been corrupted by the Dark Chi, there's no doubt that he knows the truth of those words, but he will go to any lengths to deny it. Don't believe me. Ask your brother, MK. After he escaped this prison, I found him at death's door. Like any good villain, there's a lot of truth to what he's saying. These people who have been needled were victims. Together, we can wipe the Badlands clean. It's a moment to not only uplift them, but I'm desperately trying as well for them to connect with me. You treat the gift like it is a weapon that you can wield. It is not. It's MK proving his trust to Pilgrim with taking out the Master, and I think he also shows he has what it takes to make that final kill. You will stand by my side as my most trusted warrior and my one true son. When this final bit of humanity is scrubbed out of MK is when this person comes in and says, I love you and you're my son. You're not my sister. She died so that I could live. I'm standing right in front of you, Sanzo. Stop playing mind games with me and tell me what you want. I want you to remember who you are. When Sonny meets Kanan is an interesting moment because prior to that, he really wanted to find out what happened to her. But she's a really key, important figure in Sonny discovering who he really is. Do you believe me now? We really wanted to do an episode that was about Sonny. When the sand runs out, it will be your duty to end the young man's life. It reaches great emotional resonance for him as he uncovers the truth about who he is, about Azra, what happened. No, I can't. Killing is your destiny, Sanzo. Sunny's realization in this episode, and for the audience as well, that there are no utopias. There's that sense at the end of the episode of an epiphany. They can resolve this and they can defeat Pilgrim together. We shot that in a blizzard in the middle of Glendalock, which is an amazing national park in Ireland, and it was just a magical moment. They really feel like they're walking with purpose and that they're headed off to final conflict, and it really is, I think, a powerful image.